Hello and welcome to Linux Hint YouTube channel. Today in this video we are going to talk about constants in the C programming language. So what are constants? Variables can be declared as constants which means their value cannot change once initialized. To create a constant variable which itself is a contradictory statement since we are using the words constant and then variable. So we simply say to declare constants we use the keyword const which is c-o-n-s-t. We can also use the define preprocessor. So if you see over here, we've already talked about creating a constant using the const keyword. So let's try creating a const integer value. I'm going to call it uh, xyz and I'm going to give it some value like 12. These const values work exactly like normal variables, which means that I can use them in different functions or places where they're required. For example, if I tried to print out this value, I would simply use the normal printf function and say something like the value of the constant is as and since this was an integer value I'm going to use percentage %d and then I'm going to say xyz. So if I run this code the constant works just like a normal variable. So what is the difference? The difference comes when I try changing the value of the constant. If I say something like xyz is now 13. First up you can see the squiggly lines. Now I'm using an extension which is the IntelliSense which is telling me that you are trying to change a constant value this will not let the program to compile so let's ignore this intelligence and let's try executing the program and we would see the actual cause of this error let me bring this up so if you focus over here the error is assignment of a read only variable xyz so unlike normal variables which are read and write variables you can create them assign them values read them and change their values again Constants are read-only variables. For the first time they allow writing as well. But after they have been initialized, they become read-only which means you cannot change their values. So the question is why should you even use them if they don't even allow us the functionality to change them. You are in a certain situation where you want to declare constants. That means nothing in the program or anything that the compiler does can change their value. Such as the value of pi. If we were to talk about mathematical equations, we can take an example of pi. So if I want to declare pi, I can use a variable but it's better to use a constant because I know that at no point in the whole program the value of pi is going to change. So if I create a constant float and I'm going to name it pi and I'm going to use the value 3.1415. Let's try using this value of pi to calculate the area of a circle. And then we need a radius as well. So let's take the radius as integer radius as 2. So let's calculate this float area. As you can see I wrote a very basic program for calculating the area of a circle whose radius is 2. So if I run this program it would give me the output which is 12.566. So the bottom line is you use constants when you want to declare some values which cannot change or must not change during the execution of the program. Another way of creating constant is by using the define preprocessor. Now we know what our preprocessor is. If not, then these statements that you write at the beginning of the program with the hashtag are known as preprocessors. So for this, I'll use the preprocessor define. And then I'll simply use the variable name that I want to give it, followed up by the value. And in preprocessor, you do not have to put semicolons at the end. So my program, if I render once again, will execute the exact same way. Anyways, that was constants in the C programming language and how to use and declare constants. 